Welcome back, everyone, to Shit is on Fire. Hello? Anybody there? Oh, hey, it's you! Look what happened to the ship! Uh, that's we bad. have to do something! It's not safe here! This way! No shit, it's not safe here! Uh, run. Run fast. Run very fast. It might be a bad thing. That's fucked up. The new world crash. in the tent. It has a map in it. Well, part of one at least. Cool. Looks like we're right around here. The Research Commission's base of operations is here. This is where our ship was supposed to dock. For now, I think it would be best if we make our way to base. The map should help us find our way. Okay, so for those of you who don't, uh, who are unsure of how I'm gonna play this, if there's like any extra bullshit, I will do that off screen. If there's, uh, like important, well, not even really important quests, I might even do side quests too. But, um, look, the research commission. I'll, I'll do stuff like that Come on. Let's on get screen. going. But just like gathering shit that. Oh, I have no weapon. I forgot about that. 
Uh, but... Like the gathering shit, now that can be done off screen. According to the map, to get to HQ, we need to... Hmm. Does not sound very convincing. These Abdenoths seem every bit as docile as the ones back home. I missed my gun. It looks like we need to go around. Something's up. The scout flies are gathering. What a weird plant. There's one over here, too. Come on. I think I found the way back to base. I think you're going to get a skill. I had the scout flies memorize my scent earlier. If you lose sight of me, just follow the scout flies, and they'll lead you right to me. Over here. Oh, that's you. Okay. I thought it was like a blue orb telling me somewhere else to go, but no, it's just a weird way of pointing to you. We can push our way through these vines. Oh, oh good. Giant pissed off lizards. Get going while we still can. Hmm. <clears throat> Nothing can stop us. Especially gravity. Track. Look. Look. There's more over there. Let's check it out. I don't like you. Really big lizard. Don't mind me. This way, hurry. Okay, let's go. Move.
Yeah, just as long as it doesn't fucking turn around, I'll be fine. Move! That is not good. What are you waiting for? Get over here! Wow. Amazing, oh. ain't it? Just look at this gate. It's like nature meant for us to build a stara right here. A stara. I like it. <laughs> the rest of the fifth are already here. You're the last to arrive. Be right back. You're alive. Had a rough, huh? When we couldn't find you two, we were starting to sweat bullets. You scared us. We were talking about going out to look for you. <laughs> All's well that ends well. Hey, we need a hand. Sorry. Come on. Catch you later. <laughs> This here is our trade yard. I guess the name says it all. Huh. Look at all the people. The stuff. Incredible. Right? <laughs> We've got it all here. We've got hunters to do all the exploring. Scholars to do the research. Technicians to keep them going. This place is the beating heart of the commission. Wait here a second. Commander, I found him. Welcome to Aster. You've been in command as long as I have. You learn to learn. You start to learn who's capable and who isn't. Now, as much as I'd like to get you up to speed, I'm being pulled in about eight directions at once. The life of a cook. We'll cover the important matters at council, which I'll be convening once things settle down. I expect you two to be there. For us. Your reputations precede you. The guild spoke highly of you as individuals. Think what you can do as a team. Before I forget, your fu your fury, furry friend was looking for you. Poor thing washed up not too long ago. Go ahead and have a look around Astera. A horn will sound when it's time for count. Well, off you go. Well, off you go. Okay, I'll give you the grand tour. Let's start by looking for your palico. Yes, I need my meat. This is our stockpile. They carry most of the basic necessities. Let me, let me pause. You should drop by later to see what they have. Oh, I can't pause. I forgot about that about this game. So, um, for those of you who don't know, and this will be a little bit sad, I made, um... Made my palico look like my cat Miss Kitty who passed away this past Max November. Is the smithy. It's this way. And um Over if here. you've seen the Geekus Theoreticus podcast on 
Asmagon's channel or some of my other videos, you've seen her climb all over my chair. Um, you were the commission's fifth fleet. Right? Yeah, it. Uh, the old man in charge, my grandfather, was with the first. That was a long time ago. It. Uh, hey, not with any fleet. Shut up. Born and bred right it here. It was. Uh, Never even been to the old world. It brought up a lot of old feelings, making, making a palico that looked like a. Here's our smithy. This is where you can craft weapons and armor. You'll be here a lot. Wow! Look at this place. Want to check it out? Ooh, it's toasty in here. Fucking smithy. Want to get going? The canteen? I am so there. Over here. Well, this here is our canteen. Hmm. Hey, over there. Oh. <laughs> I knew you pulled through. Right. We're calling for a council. Come on. Yeah. Now that you are all here, let us begin council. After tracking a migrating elder dragon across the sea, the fifth fleet have finally arrived in Astera. Give them a warm welcome. They're a fine group, worthy comrades who will help see the Research Commission's long efforts finally rewarded. Would you like to say a few words? Uh, not really. Thank you, sir. We're ready to roll up our sleeves and get our hands dirty. This here is the Commission's core team. You should all get to know each other. Looking forward to it. Now, down to business. The latest monster to make the Elder Crossing is known as Zora Magdaros, a huge monster with a mountain of fire upon its back. Okay. Research Commission's job is to discover exactly why the Elder Dragons are migrating to the New World. Elder Dragons have been with us since the dawn of time. Altering the ecosystem, reshaping the land, leaving disaster in their wake. Once every decade or so, they flock to this continent. But for what reason? I don't know. With the fifth's help, we will find the missing link. Here, here. Now we're talking. Hunters, for the time being, I need you to focus on investigating our Jagras problem and securing Astera. Start by investigating the Jagras' habitat. Find out what makes him tick, and we'll go from there. Right. Okay. We're on it, sir. Everyone else, you know the drill. Make sure these hunters have everything they need. Now we're talking! You two, make it a priority to learn how we do things around here. You'll find good teachers, so don't be afraid to ask. You heard him. Stick with me and you'll have no problems. The fifth banner promises a change in the wind. It's your job to fulfill that promise. All right, dismissed. Okay. Mm -hmm. How do you even hear a whole day and already got your first mission? You really are ready to get your hands dirty. Well, let's go look into this Jagger's problem, but you'll need a Over weapon here. first. Yes, that will happen from time to time. I'm very sad.
We've placed some basic gear for you in that equipment box. Make sure to choose a weapon that suits you. Just cause I uh... Ow. Oh, holy shit. Okay. I don't think I equipped the right thing. Want to get going? Once you're ready, head to the canteen. I'll be there waiting with a quest. You can get more familiar with your weapons at the training area. Just talk to the housekeeper to get started. Okay, let's run through the hunting bases. First, ready your weapon. The switch axe has two forms, axe and sword. You can power up the sword attacks by injecting them with file energy. Okay. Holy shit! Use that a slinger ammo. Great for getting a monster's attention or creating a distraction. You can use the item box to manage your inventory. The charge blade has two forms: sword and axe. Store up energy in a file and release it through the axe. I'm going with my, uh... The great sword is a powerful close-range weapon. No attacks leave you wide open. The payoff is well worth it. Oh, right. Right, I forgot about this. I didn't know what weapon I want. I was thinking about it earlier, but...
If you're clever, you can use the slinger to distract monsters. The heavy bow gun is a high-powered ranged weapon. It does a lot of damage and lets you use more powerful ammo. Normal ammo. Wait a minute, I thought there was... This might be the one. The light bow gun is a lightweight ranged weapon that's great for quick attacks and maneuverability. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with... Yes, return to headquarters. Handlers sort through the research commission's leads. And the ones they deem worth our attention become quests. Hey! Over here! This is our first job. Let's do a quick rule number one. Complete the objective to complete the quest. Each quest has an objective. You can't... Our current okay. objective is to eliminate a specified number of Jagras. Let's check the map. We ran into some Jagras on the way to base. The small monsters, remember? I think we saw them somewhere around here. Wanna I check may it out? kill them, please. Rule number two. Use the... The commission supplies us with a load... They're in the supply box over there. Have a look. And decide what you should take along. Oh, yeah. Hey, partner. Want to get going? Uh huh.
Ready your weapon before attacking. Keep in mind that what you're able to do depends on whether or not your weapon is drawn. Be careful. When you're investigating or gathering items, you'll generally want to keep your weapon sheathed. Hey! You can gather honey and mix it with a potion to make mega potions. I'll mark gathering sites and monster positions on the wildlife map for you. A pack of Jagras! Those are the monsters we're after! Let's see how you hold up when you're on your own. Right. Up. There we go. This is not going how I want it. They're on the run. Don't let them get away. Grab all the monster materials you can. You can use them at the smithy. Oops. Use whatever you can. That's what I wanted earlier. Dodge their attacks. You don't want to take hits like that head on. Back here. Bright moss can be used as slinger ammo. Launch it at walls to eliminate dark areas, like the inside of a cave, for example. Okay, let's head home and report back to the old man.
Yay. Good to see you. And we're taking down those jaguars. Hmm. So there's no difference in their habitat, but their numbers uh -huh. are increasing. So staying in the obvious, but jaguars are feeling dangerous. We've also received reports of a Kestodon who is getting out of hand. This all must be because Sora Magdras made landfall. It's got everything Listen up. up. Now it's going to be your job to quiet them down. We'd like you to investigate the Kestodon herd and cold Long wouldn't want you to get hurt. All right. Now that you've got some materials, why don't we head over to the smithy to see what you can do with them? I'm gonna change my weapon. Doesn't really seem like a fucking katana based on size. Some materials. Why don't we head over to the smithy to see what you can do with them? Okay. Honestly, that's probably where I'm gonna end to the. Uh, get on with the smithy. My my my.
This is kind of cool. Yes. It seems broken, so I'm gonna do it. It's serrated. Okay. to leave it there because now I have a new badass katana that doesn't really seem like a katana but um yeah so I hope y'all enjoyed also please leave a like subscribe to the channel if this is your first time and uh if you are interested I have a link down to my YouTube sponsor Dubby if you would like some of their you know apparel stickers uh, shakers or even some of their drinks I have a 10% off discount down in the description below. Hope y'all enjoy, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye! Thank you all for watching. Thank you for making it this far. And I just wanted to say a special thank you to my patrons up in this corner who have been supporting my channel for a pretty long time, for most of them. They are the ones who... Without them and without the people on my Discord, link in the description, uh, I would never have made it this far with my YouTube channel. So a very special thank you to them. Also, I have two videos. I believe the top one is the one that's recommended per viewer on my channel. And then the one in the bottom is the most recent upload. So give those a check. Let me know what you think on them. But the most important thing of all... I know we're all going through hard times. Just try and be there for one another. Try and lift each other up. That's one of the biggest things I try to make on my Discord where we're all one big, not necessarily a community, but family. And when someone just needs someone just to listen to, just be there for them. But with that being said, I hope you all enjoyed the video. I hope you all have a very wonderful day. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye!